What do we need to be healthy and well? A good start in life. A place we can call home. Enough money to get by. Access to good food. Friends and family we can count on. A sense of safety and belonging. And plenty of opportunities for working, playing, connecting and learning. These are the building blocks of a healthy city for all. Is this vision too ambitious? Surely we all deserve to live in a city in which we're not just surviving, but where we're thriving. And many of us are thriving. Vancouver's famous for our spectacular natural setting, our urban planning, and our active people. But many of our fellow residents are struggling. The good news is that it doesn't have to be this way. And the Healthy City Strategy is the city's plan for creating a healthy city for all of us. The Healthy City Strategy doesn't reinvent the wheel, Instead, it connects the dots, making sure that we are planning in an integrated way for environmental, economic, and social needs. We've identified 12 big goal areas and some big targets that we want to reach by 2025. Some of these, like getting around, have a whole strategy in place already and progress is being made. But the rest of them have new targets, which will help us to move from where we are today to where we want to be in 2025. And taken together, if we reach them all, Vancouver will become a healthy city for all. But we can't reach any of these targets on our own. Everyone has a part to play and something to gain. Research shows that countries that have less of a gap between the haves and the have-nots enjoy higher levels of health and well-being for everyone. So how do we get there? Einstein famously said that we can't solve our problems at the same level of thinking with which we created them. That's where you come in. We need new ways of thinking, new ways of acting, and new ways of working together. Be part of the Talk Healthy City for All discussion. Get involved, share your boldest and best ideas, and let's make them happen.